When Saskatoon's Miki Mappin looked down almost a decade ago to see a long-awaited F for female on her driver's license and other ID, she was overcome with excitement. That's because after much back and forth with government officials to have her sex designation changed, it offered her as a transgender woman a sense of validation. It was great. I felt so happy and proud. In 2019, SGI gave people another choice using a gender-neutral X, but that didn't resonate with everyone. Now, a Saskatchewan Human Rights Complaint Settlement Agreement, combined with customer feedback, has prompted SGI to offer up another option. We heard from our members of our community who said they prefer the option of no letter. So in consultation with the Human Rights Commission, we've now been able to put the resources and processes in place in order for us to leave that spot entirely blank. And that's something Morgan Motes, the chair of You Are Pride in Regina, hopes to do. As a non-binary person, Motes doesn't identify as either male or female. They say an empty space offers more safety than an ex because it leaves room for fewer questions. Because an ex says, I am not a man or a woman, whereas the blank says, it's none of your business. But for Mappin, who fought so hard to have the sex designation changed on her driver's license, the idea of taking that off is complicated. There's just the validation of being able to, you know, somebody says, oh, you're not a woman. And, uh, you know, you can say, well, I am, you know, and I've got my driver's license. Like, <laughs> I don't know. But we really shouldn't need to have our driver's license to prove our gender or our sex. Motes agrees, but says this new blank space option can spark much needed conversation. People who are maybe confused or uninformed can take a moment to go like, why, why do we even need this? And, you know, hopefully there's someone in their life that can respond with, you know, so that people can be safe and comfortable and authentically themselves. SGI says anyone can make the change to their ID for free at any license issuer. Jesse Anton, CBC News, Regina.